The LA City Council has officially weighed in on the war in Ukraine. It unanimously passed a resolution condemning Russia's actions. The measure also calls for international and federal divestment of all holdings from Russia. Councilman Paul Koretz, who introduced the resolution with Council President Nuri Martinez, Martinez and three other members, says the city stands firmly with Ukraine and its people. In Orange County, a concert to benefit Ukraine. It streams tonight at 7 o'clock. Yeah, the Chamber Music OC concert will feature a violinist who grew up in Ukraine and wants to help out the best way she can. Keiko 9's Rena Nakano spoke to her about her pain and also the power of music. When the conflict in Ukraine broke out, concert violinist Irina Krichkovsky felt helpless. I was born and raised in Ukraine, in Ivano-Frankivsk, which is in the western part of Ukraine. She immigrated to Canada, then the States, with her family when she was 13, but she still feels a close attachment. Then she got word that her cousin, also a violinist for the Kyiv Opera, joined the Ukrainian army. You know, feels guilty um, to be here, to be safe, and, and but we're trying to do what we can. So with the help of her violinist sister Marta and fellow musicians, Krichkovsky planned a benefit concert. These are the pieces that I grew up with. A paid streaming event out of the Chamber Music OC performance room featuring classical Ukrainian standards. All proceeds will go toward humanitarian aid provided by the United Ukrainian American Relief Committee. How do we reach as many people as possible if we can't physically have them here? Uh, so we decided that doing a, a live stream is the most logical solution. The concert link will be sent to anyone who donates any amount of money, even a dollar, to the Chamber Music OC website. She says there's something about music that brings people closer together, even in the darkest times. What I would want Ukrainian people to know is that they're not alone and that we together uh, can lift not only the spirits but provide the confidence and the strength to Ukrainian people to keep fighting for, for their freedom and to live in the country that they love. In Lake Forest, I'm Rena Nakano, KCAL 9 News. Ah, so beautiful. beautiful. So again, all the proceeds will go toward humanitarian aid in Ukraine. And for more on tonight's concert benefit, head on over to our website, kco9.com slash scene on TV.